We're in Sweden and it's time for me to have my first fight in the UFC. So we're here training before we go to the arena. I'm just trying to stay relaxed and really enjoy being here and being focused on the fight and what I should do. Yep. Nice, girl. Damn, you're on point. You know that? You know, if I get home, she's comfortable in this environment. She knows everybody. Her family's here, all of her friends, people that she knows. At the end of the day, you're gonna go in there and get in a fist fight. Door's gonna shut and all that stuff goes away. Good, single, single, single. Yep. Stop, stop, stop beating. Stop beating this guy up. <laughs> Dial it down just a little bit. <laughs> He's so ready to go. People love striking. She's a world champion in striking. She likes to stand and bang. As far as the game plan goes, we've prepared everywhere and we're ready to take the fight wherever it goes. Good, nice. Yep, just like that. <laughs> Shut it down, that's enough. She's done, she's ready. Okay. Yep. Should we rock and roll? Yep. Sure. Make it Semtex. <laughs> oh yeah, no problem. <laughs> the way that we look at it is the athletes done the work through the camp, put in the grind, put in the sweat. That's the success. The fight is just the cherry on top. The fight is them showcasing that to their friends, to their family, for themselves. Right now, we just want to get her warmed up out of the so she's ready to go right when she hits the cage. She flew halfway across the world, stayed in a place that she's never been in, got tortured for seven weeks, did everything I asked her to do. So no matter what, I'm super proud of her, and I'm excited for her. It's all on her now, you know? When the athlete goes in there, it's, it's them. Like you have to. Inside here? Yeah, yeah. A group hug. We'll hug it here and then we're done. All right. Yep. Let's go. And just listen to that welcome for Stockholm's very own. Center holding the ground and throwing punches, and Bear Malek is moving laterally, moving around her, trying to pick her off. Speed, no power, Bear. Take down for Duda, good head position as well. Now she's trying to control the hips as Bear's working back to her feet. Malek out, starts working her jab now. She needs to really land some significant strikes here. Good job, sit down. I need all speed. That's way too slow. You're way too slow out there. Well, just look at me. One, one, two. Just try to touch her. One, one, two. One, one, two. Right? And move. Oh, set for round Let's number go. two in this women's bantamweight contest. <laughs> Maleki throwing out that jab. Oh, nice. Good work by Santana to follow up behind him and forces her against the fence. Yeah, this is important for Maleki to try to D this one up. She ends up on top. Beautiful job. The Swedish fan. Adjustment there from Malecki, getting the body triangle, staying on top. She's out, she's out. Oh, wow. oh, and a big throw from Malecki. And she probably has come from behind here to get a win in front of her home fans. We're playing the winner by submission due to a rear naked choke. to fight at home and all these people you guys share for me. Thank you so much. How many people make a UFC debut in their hometown? So many people here to see her and so much expectation. The first round was a little shaky. We thought if she got on top of her and got her back and got that body lock, she was gonna be able to get it done and she did.
work. Oh, that grind. Maybe because it was my debut, I needed one round to like, you know, feel it. We, we said we're gonna take her down. As soon as she got down, I took her back and I knew I was gonna get it. Like, when I was there, I'm like, I'm gonna get it. Even if I couldn't really get it in, I was like, oh, it's coming, it's coming.